omega-3 fats reduce prostate cancer risk in men at high risk for the disease. Hi, I'm Dr. James Machino. You know, a breakthrough study in clinical cancer research in 2009 showed that the ingestion of omega-3 fats was associated with a 63% reduced risk of prostate cancer. What was amazing in this study is that it even protected men who had an inherited genetic risk for developing prostate cancer, who otherwise would have a five-fold increased risk of prostate cancer. But by the omega-3 fat intake, the, the men that had that intake were able to get uh, a tremendous protection against the disease, even though there's a, there's a genetic risk. So let me explain that. Some men, for genetic reasons, make a particular enzyme. It's called the cyclooxygenase, and it's a certain variation of that enzyme that makes them more inclined to produce these prostaglandin hormones that increase risk of prostate cancer. How does that happen? Well, these particular prostaglandin hormones increase inflammation and make cells divide at a faster rate. When cells divide faster, they make more genetic mistakes that lead to cancer. So if a man has that genetic uh, variation of the enzyme, they tend to make more of these hormones that cause inflammation and faster cell division leading to cancerous mutations. But men that are having the omega-3 fats, the omega-3 fats become the raw material for a type of prostaglandin that has the opposite effect, that is anti-inflammatory and slows down the rate of cell division, which in turn decreases the chance that, that cancer would develop. So here you have a situation where you have the omega-3 fats countering the body's natural inclination to produce hormones that would cause more rapid cell division the omega-3 fat sort of stepping in, producing a different type of hormone that actually has the opposite effect. Now, other studies have shown in the past that omega-3 fat intake is associated with a lower risk of prostate cancer, but the 2009 study illustrates that omega-3 fats may, may reduce the risk of prostate cancer in men who are susceptible to prostate cancer for certain genetic reasons. It's an, example, it's a, it's an excellent example that highlights the interaction between faulty genes and dietary and environmental factors and how certain dietary and lifestyle factors can help suppress the expression of genes that would otherwise pose a threat to our health. There are many other examples like this. This is why diet and supplementation is so important. So what I'd like you to do is click on the link below to read my blog article on this subject. And it also explains the, the exact dosage of, of omega-3 fats that are necessary to reduce prostate cancer risk according to the 2009 article. This is vital because every man needs to know this information because one in six men develops prostate cancer in our society. So it's vitally important, read the blog article and get the rest of the details there. Now remember that at machinohealth.com you'll see my other research review papers, you'll see footage from my live professional seminars. You'll see downloads and resources and other videos I've created. They're all there to help you lead a long, healthy, functional life. All my research papers and teaching materials are complete with all the scientific references, so you'll always know you're getting evidence-based information from me on any health topic that you're looking for. So you should use machinohealth.com as an ongoing, reliable resource of health and wellness information for both you and your family. Thanks so much for watching.